We conclude this week with Steve Hartman, who has one request. Don't jump to conclusions. Here we are, just two seconds into this story, and some of you may have already made some assumptions about our subject, Maury Forrester. But the students here at Coulter Grove Intermediate School near Knoxville, Tennessee, All right. say, be wary of that first impression. Hey guys. You never know what people have done. I was surprised. It makes you wonder, like, how did he get here? Liftoff, we have a liftoff. 77-year-old Maury Forrester was part of the team that helped put a man on the moon. Zero, zero. During the Saturn and Four. Apollo programs, he worked for a zero, subcontractor zero. that designed crucial launch components. Zero. Here go. I look at it now, I'm amazed that it happened. It was so complex and so involved, and there were so many people. His certificates and awards could fill a corner office, and yet here he is in a broom closet a highly trained electromechanical designer on the business end of a mop. In 2014, Maury suffered a stroke, or something like it, doctors aren't quite sure, but the result was clear, a major loss of cognitive function. Maury says it was humbling and humiliating, but he knew if he wanted to keep on living, he had to keep on working. He originally took this job solely for the exercise. But over the last few months, he has become an integral part of this school community. I just love it. They're happy to see me. Thank you guys and I'm so happy much. to see them. Thank you. I've gotten to care very much for them. Thank you, guys. And the students clearly feel the same. In fact, Maury says they even say, I love you. Yeah. Just hearing that makes, it makes all the difference to me. And nobody ever said that at NASA? <laughs> no, not that I can remember. <laughs> Which leads me to the most astonishing part of this story. Oh, gosh. After that, I asked Maury. Hey, guys. What if by some miracle he got his mind back and could go back to his old job? There was no hesitation. Yeah, I can't, I can't say that I'm going to give this up. I'm good. How are you? Some people never figure out the key to a successful career. But Maury shows it's not rocket science. Steve Hartman, On the Road near Knoxville, Tennessee.